Good evening, everyone. My name's Ethan Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Nino Kuni. It's a, a game from like 2011, but it's for the PlayStation 3. It's amazing, and there's an entire series on it. So if this is your first time ever watching one of these episodes, I highly recommend that you go back and see all the other stuff that I've done. Ooh, I'm not jumping far. Oh wait, 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 wait. Can't we um, give that to somebody? Oh, wait, not that. There we go. Oh, no, not that. Here we go. No, not that one either. This one. I was convinced. What is this? Increases his attack by two. Hey, his fullness is not full. Yeah, eat it, buddy. <laughs> I keep forgetting that. It's awesome. Okay. Uh, increases his attack. Awesome. Defense. We'll increase that. I want to increase his attack completely, so. We can give him another another attack. What is his attack up to? It's up to 80? Wow. I should probably go buy him a new sword or something. <laughs> he loves chocolate, just like me. <laughs> Wait, what does this one do? Increase magical attack. Uh, who was it? Oh, you had a pretty good one. Was it you? Hold on. Who was it that had, like, the wicked magic attack? Water bubble or whatever it was called. I think it was Jason. Let's get it to Jason. Jason, there you go, buddy. Have cupcake. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Uh, oh, wait. I also have a cool thing that we got last time. Follow the formula. Oh, look at this. We got a whole bunch of stuff. We have 38 salted ice cream. Mm. We don't have any formulas for weapons or armor or accessories. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> um, Spirit Dew. There we go. That's that's the one that she was talking about. We need a bottle of Pixie Dew, a bottle of sour grapes, or sorry, a bunch of sour grapes, and uh, needed and in bag. We've got nothing. We've got none of that. So we can't mix anything. Okay, fine. Let's get. Skedaddle. Now, if we look at the map, I don't think they're. Nope. They're at the end. See that? Alright, let's head down there. The music seems really loud again today. Oh, wonderful. I do not think I have ever been this excited. It's kind of like meeting a YouTuber. But <laughs> so, uh, now that the candle cutter is uh, now, to make a candle cutter, you need a flint dagger and also an ember stone. Flip and heck, you don't have uh, You don't have no your stuff. You don't have no your stuff. <laughs> it is all in my book. I shall wait for you here. Please hurry, I'm very excited. Okay, can I actually move when you okay. you're just going to be What's he saying? He said something. I'll buy your wares. No, nope, not you. Um, hold on. Can I can I please 
Let's go to buy. Um, log feather. Pig, iron pike, iron axe. You don't have what I'm looking for. He doesn't think so. I hope to see you again soon. I wonder if they have accents. You know, most places that I've traveled to, you know, is tell like a little bit of an accent. You know, and that's that's mostly Minnesota. And if you head over towards like, uh... oh gosh, hey, we changed back into our local normal clothes. Uh, we have to head back to Alma Moon and get that letter. Here we go! Oh, oh my gosh! Sound effects I'll leave up. Mm, text display speed. Nice. Normal. Normal. Gold. Gilded. Guiding star. Mm, excuse me. Confirmed. Confirmed. There we go. Music is down a little bit. That way you guys can actually hear my voice. Because I mean, that's the main reason you come here is to listen to me babble on about things. Right? It's not really for the gameplay. The gameplay is a nice storyline in the background. Oh gosh. I'm glad that can't stop. Oh, we got a whetstone. Yay! It could probably be used to sharpen things. I'm gonna attack you, dude. It's a manolith. We're under attack! Monolith and a Perleon noble. Here goes! <laughs> Change attack. Oh, how do I? How do I change attack? Okay, there we go. Now I should be able to switch over to the other. I'll give it my all. Are you ready? Sam Aid. La 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 la. You obtained the monolith. The monolith. Nido. Sorry, not funny. Yes, I want to keep him. Uh, Rocco. Hold on. Let's go into the comments of uh, today's, which would have been yesterday's. Let's go see what we have. Um, up there. There we go. So, in today's Nino Kuni, Wrath of the White Witch, is where we put on our bathing suits and everything. We have a whole bunch of people who have uh, commented. And let's just see. Keep the amazing work. Don't stop the videos from Jonathan. Um, Extreme Zai Zai says 13. I got a smiley face. Oh, there's nothing there. I don't know what to say. Just smile. Notification gang from Gunther. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. No, almost first like. Who is who is first? Nice. Good job. Uh, 
Craven RBX, but the one that actually got me with an actual good comment, a nice comment, was Mr. Jonathan. Jonathan Foss Anderson. So, we're just going to call this one Jonathan. Let's go to the left. Jonathan, thank you for the nice comment. You get a heart and a like. And you won. I mean, it wasn't really a competition, but I hope you like the comment. I hope, I hope you like the response. That bird is way up there. Look at that. Can we, did you see that? That was a huge bird. You now, aren't there missions in the old one that we had to do? I think. I think so. Oh, are you running away or are you running towards us? You were straight up running away. You're like, no, that guy's powerful. Get away from him. Come here, banana man. Okay, we didn't we didn't have to run too far. That's fine. There we go. Back to Alma Moon. Isn't this where we met Esther? And then we had to go to the trials and things. So where do we need to go exactly? <clears throat> Weren't you listening, Cloth here? You're so insulting, Drippy. To where the Calo 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 Califa Califa is. I'm gonna call it Califa. Ain't it? The place, man. The palace. It's beyond the main square, Oliver. I'll show you the way. <laughs> he just nods. Thanks. Huh? Oh, thief! Hmm? Yikes! What's wrong, Esther? Oh, sorry, he doesn't have an accent. What's wrong, Esther? Nothing. I had a funny feeling that we were being followed for a second. I'm sure it's nothing. Sorry. Let's go. Let's get going, shall we? Sure. <clears throat> By the beards of mighty, the regal lines, the majestic curve of of the nostril. Your nose, it is uh, in every respect the same. The same as hers. I'm sorry? Come on. Please, you must... Okay, I, I don't know what this guy sounds like yet, so we're just gonna make it up. Please, you must let me study it. What? Who are you? Ah, uh, forgive me. I am a humble artist. I am currently painting a portrait of the one whom you bear the most striking resemblance. I look like a person in your portrait. Indeed. And alas, I am unable to meet her in the flesh. Will you not allow me to study you a little more? Well, if you must, go ahead. <laughs> okay, creeper. <laughs> the line is the jealous key. Of course, thank you. I am in your debt. I know just what I must do to finish my masterpiece. You are, and you have my eternal gratitude. Um, that's all right. You're very welcome. You must return to my studio right away. Farewell. Or no, I must return to my farewell studio. Wow. I wonder who that person was. That is who look, looks. I wonder who that person is that looks like me. Whoever it is, the artist certainly seems to think. She's rather beautiful. <laughs> Crikey, these arty, arty types are a bit intense, ain't it? Not to mention a bit flippin' weird. <laughs> that poor kid is going to puke. <laughs> running off in the back. Did you guys see that? That looked like Oliver after he's been running around the house crazy. Hmm, what do you mean? Oh, nothing. Just that, you know, he was a bit funny. Did you th think so? 
Just me, was it? Righto, I'll shut my big mouth, I shall. So, time to get moving, is it? Sure, let's go. <laughs> this poor kid's over here like, wah, wah, wah. <laughs> I mean, look at the look at the puke pile that he's left. I'm just kidding, that's sand. Let's go. <laughs> Hi, daddy -o. Wait, can we talk to him? The great sage is somewhere in the far east. We must find the sage. I must investigate. So I was like, that's Okay. I don't know how you're going to investigate or my business to tell Oh, wait, 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 wait. Give me... Hold on. Is this her? Hey! Ha ha ha! The boneheads? Now your supplies can get through safely, ma'am. Have a nice day. I can't thank you enough. You've saved all my life. Please, you must accept this as a reward. The bone sword! Is that isn't that what we needed to make the, the cutter or something? Maybe not. Yay! Wow, that guy has three merit stamps. And then did you have something as well? What did you need? Bone asked for delivery to her beloved husband's lunch. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I hope my dearest darling husband has a collapsed with hunger. Oh, I'm so worried. I'm so very worried, my love. I guess I forgot that we were supposed to drop that one. And did we get this book? Did my suspicions correct? I thought that it completely composed him somewhere near the tree of the old volcano there. But then it's somewhat lost in creativity. Okay, we never got the map. Man, lots of missions that I'm just kind of leaving behind, but that's... That's okay, we got things to do. Tidy! Here's, uh, this here is the palace. Let's get ourselves inside, shall we? Yes. I bet the guard stop it. I bet the guard stop it. Halt! You may not pass. <laughs> you shall not pass. What? You shall not. You think you can just walk into the palace of our most revered cow? Unannounced? What seems to be the problem here? Master Ab Ab Abul. Master Abul. These miscreants were attempting to enter the palace without permission. Is that so? Wait. You are Babana Merchant's daughter, are you not? I am Abu, advisor to the most esteemed cow. <laughs> Your father's efforts to supply Her Majesty with the Babanas are, as ever, most highly appreciated. I had heard that you were unwell. It seems that you have recovered? Yes, I'm very much better now, thank you. That is excellent news. Tell me, child, what business have you with the palace? Well, sir, you see, I was not talking to you. <laughs> Sorry, I, I made that part up. It's, it doesn't read like that. I need a ship. Uh, I need a ship, and we can't get one without a letter of passage from Cal. You and your friends wish to journey to the lands across the sea. I sympathize, and I would dearly love to arrange an audience for you, however... Is something wrong? I'm afraid the cow is... indisposed of. Much as it would please her to... She currently is unable to hear the request of any of her subjects. Oh, uh, that's too bad. Apologies, but she has requested that she is not to be disturbed under any circumstances during her afternoon snack. Then I guess we'll wait until after that? Would that you could, but her afternoon snack is immediately following, followed by her second lunch. And after that? Uh, and after that? And then comes her late afternoon snack. Um, is there any time when she's not eating? Alas, her mujesties, mujesties, oh gosh, is it going to be an actual cow? Her mujesties miraculous hunger dictates that she dine every uh, even during her sleep hours this is why I am forced to spend my every waking hour per procuring her the most beloved food ah but I must be going the most beloved food I wonder what that could be forgive me I must make the necessary arrangements before the merchant supplies are exhausted I am most terribly sorry that I am not able to grant you an audience. 
curses. I must hurry. If I cannot prepare Her Majesty, Majesty's next meal in good time, she will be most displeased. <clears throat> Master Abul has spoken. Leave this place. It looks like we don't have much choice, Oliver. Come on. We'll come back later. Hmm. So, the cow is very special favorite food, is it? Hey, I bet if we found out what it is, I bet if we found out what it is, uh, if what it was and took her some of it as a present, she'd allow us to see her. That's a neat idea, Esther, but we don't know what her favorite food is. Oi, oi, Ollie boy, you know how you can find out, don't you? Um, come on, slow couch. We go to where the what your, to your world and find her soulmate, ain't it? Of course, if we find her soulmate, we can find out what her favorite food is and give her give some to the cow. But how do we find out who the cow's soulmate is? I've never seen her before. Hmm. So we need to find out what the cow looks like, but we can't go and meet her. But if we can't meet her, how are we supposed to find out what she looks like? I saw her once in a parade. Parade. <laughs> a parade. When I was little, but it was so long ago, I can't remember anything about her. So what do we do? Jeepers. We don't know what the, cow, the cow's favorite food is, and we don't know what she looks like. I have to confess, I'm completely out of ideas too. Oh, oh, I can move around. Sweet. Bah! All this thinking makes my head hurt, Mom. Tell you what, let's get down to the cat, cat's cradle and sleep on it, shall we? I guess well, I'm kind of tired. The cat's cradle is near the entrance of town. Okay, let's go rest for a while. Let's go! Okay, so basically we're just going to follow the little star. Hello! Somebody just messaged me, but I am indisposed of the moment. I'm currently recording the video and I'm is famous. The role of the YouTuber. I'm not a real YouTuber, but I'm a real YouTuber. <laughs> the cat's in the cradle in the city of the spoon. The poor blue and the man in the moon. When you're coming home, son, I don't know when. But we'll be on the way then. You know we're gonna go to the cat's cradle Is this the cat's cradle? Jumping for joy because I made it. <laughs> Yay! Oh wait, I'm gonna go over here and steal what's ever in the pot. Thank you. <gasps> we obtained some salted ice cream and also for a little bit of magic. Spring water. Take it. <gasps> yes. Since I got a cup of coffee, I get to take a sip of coffee. That was, that was really good. Wait, is that open up there? Oh no, there's a curtain in front of it. Hello, cats in the cradle. <coughs> Welcome to the Palace of Pampering, the cream of cat's cradle establishments. Oh my, hey. I, I must apologize. Oh, oh, please, you must excuse me. Is it finished? Is it, it is really indeed. The paint finished? The paint is scarcely dry, oh. but it is completed at last. Oh, how I long to see it. Now, please, oh. hang it over here. Isn't that the artist who... Yes, it is. I wonder how his picture turned out. At last, the grand unveiling. Oh, my beloved Caulifa. So the person he thought I looked like was the Caulifa? That's how you That's fancy. It's not every day you get compared to royalty. Now feast your eyes upon the divine oh, beauty of her my. most admired oh, oh, Ujesty. Huh? <laughs> but that's... <clears throat> okay, so now that I know what she sounds like... Oh, it's divine, truly divine. Her matchless beauty takes on one's breath away. You are pleased with it? Please do why it's worth thrice what I promised to pay you for it. By beards of ma m the mighty, truly. But we shook upon it, did we not? Perhaps next time. 
I see, I see. Excuse me. Oh, she is mad. Oh. <laughs> Did you compare me to that winch up there on the... Oh, man, look at her brow. She is mad, boy. Hold on. Yes? I don't look anything like her. <laughs> you said I look like her. You misunderstood me, lady. Uh, uh, young lady. It is not the picture of you, merely... Mr. Drippy? I. <laughs> what is it, Mon? This is just getting interesting. We need to go to Motorville right now. I just realized uh, who we need to see. You did, eh? I sure did. It's Miss Layla. Uh, Miss Layla is the Khalifa... Khalifa... Khalifa soulmate. <gasps> Khalifa! Is, it, is that kind of like, uh, never mind. Never mind. We won't talk of Game of Thrones. I just know it. Uh, she is her. Of course she is. Mm, excuse me. That coffee gave me the burps. There's a clever of you, Ollie boy. Thank you, Mr. Drippy. Um, when I saw that picture, I knew right away. Right oh, Let's get moving then, shall we? I don't feel tired at all of a sudden. Me either. Hey, Esther. Uh, come on. We have to go. Huh? <laughs> I absolutely... <laughs> I look absolutely nothing like her. Do I look like that... <laughs> oh my gosh. Do I look fat to you? I am not fat. Harumph. <laughs> You're still kind of angry, huh? <laughs> what do you mean? I'm not angry in the slightest. Yeah, and I'm six foot flippin' six. <laughs> looks like we <laughs> looks like we'd best leave her to it. <laughs> I guess we should, huh? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. Okay, so we need to go outside because we we can't we can't do it on the inside. We have to have a nice big open area, which I think this is this is about right. This is good, right? Let's do it. Um, so we are going to cast a gateway. Uh, go talk to Layla in another suite. Let's... Oh, I hit the wrong button. There we go. Here we go. Up, up, and away. Web. <laughs> now, what happens to M Meredith? Yeah, I've still got Esther with me. What happens when we take Esther to go see... Okay, I know Miss Layla's, like, just north here. Hold on, can we get to... I really want to try and go talk to Esther. Esther's soulmate companion person. This should be interesting. Are we going to cause, like, a, a universal explosion by putting the soulmates together? the garage. Looks like this shop ain't open yet. I'm sure if we wait here, um, she'll be along soon. It's time to open up already. Someone's coming. Oh, hello, Oliver. 
Marital. Oh, dude! Martel, hi! How are you? How are you feeling? Are you feeling better now? I am, and it's all thanks to you, Oliva. <laughs> Wait, does she have an accent? I think Esther has an accent, but does she have an accent? I don't remember. What are you doing here? Do you need something from the store? In a moment. I'll just open it up for you. Who's the girl? I feel like... Like you know her somehow? Yes, she looks just like me. And it's... It's, uh, and it's like she's my long-lost twin or something. She looks much more like me than the stupid Calif Khalifa. Hmm? Uh, can she not see me or something? That's perspective for you. She can't see you, nor me neither. Really? So, I'm invisible. What a strange feeling. Of course you're invisible. You're in another world, ain't it? Huh? Did you say something, Oliver? Uh, no. No, I didn't. Anyways. See, this is very enlightening, because I was, I was wondering how the two perspectives work. So, Oliver is from this world. If I go over to the other world, my other half, my soulmate, do I see him? Better yet, is my soulmate the Shadar? Oh, that would be horrible. Okay, I, I've not played the end of the game. I don't know the ending. But if that is the plot twist, I am so sorry that I just ruined it. Okay? I, I don't know. Here we go. Anyways, how... <clears throat> How come you're here at Miss Leela's store, Myrtle? Hehe, <laughs> I work here now. Miss Leila and my mom are friends, and when she heard that I was better, she said that I should come work for her. Gee, that's real nice of her. Say, Mer uh, Meryl, bleh, Myrtle, is Miss Leela around? Sure, she's busy training right now, but I'm sure she'll be back soon. Oh, Miss Leila's training? That's right, she started running. Is the, is she on a diet? Hehe, <laughs> no, silly. She's exercising so that she can eat even more. Huh? How do you mean? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Mortal, I'm back. Why, if it isn't young Oliver. Hello, dearie. Good morning, Miss Leela. Mortal, I can't wait any longer, would you? Yes, Miss Leela. I'll get, get it. Uh, I'll go get it for you right now. Oh, it's no good. I just can't wait that long. I have some in the store, dear. Uh, you stay out here and clean or something. My, I never saw anyone so crazy about their favorite food. What's that? What is her favorite food? Oi, Ollie boy. I bet it's the same as uh, the Calif Califas. You're right. Let's go out. Uh, let's go find out what it is. Myrtle must think I'm crazy just talking to thin air. <clears throat> See you soon, Myrtle. <laughs> what a strange boy. Miss <laughs> um, mm, mm, mm. uh, Layla, mm, mm, mm. what is she eating? It's cheese. A whole lot of cheese. That's right, dearie, and it's not for sale. None of it. It's all for little old me. Quick, Ollie boy! She'll scoff the whole lot if you're not careful. Hurry up and grab some! Sharpish! Okay. Please, Miss Layla, could you give me a piece of your cheese? Uh, uh -huh. You know I'd do anything for you, dearie, but Please, not that. Just oh, one no, piece. no, no, no. Just one no, tiny I said no! Piece, man. It's mine! Heave with all your might! Have it. I'll Come never on, let you have it! it. It's Come mine! On. Mine, oh. I tell you! All mine! Oh. It's kind of a shock, huh? It sure is. I had no idea. I had no idea that she was so obsessed. Hehe. <laughs> it's better not to go near her when she's eating cheese. I know that now. Myrtle. Myrtle! Oh, wait. That was... That was Miss Leela saying that. It sounds like she needs my help. I'd better get going inside. Thank you so much for the subscribe. I don't know who it was. I don't have the notifications up there, but thank you. I'd better go inside. Goodbye now. 
Jeepers, what do we do now? Miss Layla's store is the only place in town that sells cheese. Oliver! What's wrong? Oh, hi, P. We kind of need some cheese. Cheese? That's right. It's the Khalifa's favorite food. Who is he talking to now? <clears throat> Must be his imaginary friend again. He, it, here we flip and go. Huh? We can make it. We can make our own cheese? Yes, with your magic. Lots and lots of cheese. But I can't. I don't know how. Yes, you do. Just try. Just try. You really think it's that easy? Yes. But do I even have a spell to use with the... Hey, wait! She's gone. Have fun talking to your imaginary friend, did you? Holly boy. Better than talking to your real friends, was it? Huh? Imaginary friend? You mean P? P? Who's that? What do you mean? She was right here. Um, I didn't see anyone. Maybe you're the only one that can see her, Oliver. Really? But how come? Well, maybe it's just like how Mer Myrtle can't see me, but I can see her. You might be right, you know. I've never seen this P either. Anyways, what did P say to you, Oliver? Oh, yeah, she told us that we can use magic to make some cheese. What's that? Make it with magic, you say? Well, she may be too shy to let us see her, but she ain't afraid to stick her neck out in, uh, of advice-wise. Oh my gosh, I just realized I've gone over by 36 minutes. Uh, we'll finish it out. I'm so sorry that it's going this long. You mean it, it won't work? Nah, man. It work. It'll work. The whole point of magic is to make the impossible possible, ain't it? But I guess it's difficult without uh, the right ingredients, huh? But we do have them. We do? <laughs> of course we do. Back at Alma Moon, the fountain of milk. So we use... We use magic to turn the milk from the fountain into cheese. Now that we can do. Tidy. Right, oh, Wally boy. Let's get back to our world, shall we? Let's, uh, yes, let's go straight to the fountain of milk and give it a try. And try it out. There in the main square of Al Mamoon. If they have mountain. I don't understand this world sometimes. Wait, what happened? Can't wait. Actually, no. we are going to save right there. Save new data? Yes, save new data. And we shall continue next time. Thank you, everyone, for watching this episode of Nino Kuni. With me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos. But it's really up to you. It's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool, too. I love you guys anyway. You were here. You watched. You had fun. Um, yeah. That's it. We'll talk to you real soon.